Yo, what's up, everyone? Welcome back to another video. Today's video, we got the Elitch God himself, Victor. Guys, for those who don't know, every time I'm playing Elitch, I just ask Victor, Yo, Victor, like, what should I play? And he gave me all the sauce. Bro, you finished second at regionals. Why don't you explain to my people what you did? I just came second. No, you didn't. But you came first in our hearts, bro. And he whooped my ass, which is more important than any first or second place. How did it feel? How was the deck? Yeah, it was pretty good. Um, being Triff 2 0. With Whoop my ass, destroyed me, bro. You're um, you're the best Yu-Gi-Oh player in the GTA after Triff Gaming. Uh, uh, before we get into it, is there any shout outs you would like to give? Uh, shout out to my Victor. Get more excited, bro. Yeah. Guys, at locals, this guy does some like he's always super excited. Does some super sus stuff with uh, that guy in the corner right there and uh, over. <laughs> right, okay, Sosa. Thank God. <laughs> what? Oh, nothing, nothing, <laughs> bro. But yeah, so, trash. huh? You trash. you trash. You just cost us a game of cube. Yeah, I don't know what you did that game. I won us game put one. A, at least put in a board. I won us game one. I won game one. Hello? I won game one. You did shit all. You did shit all. <laughs> so, so I'm kidding, bro. You're a great teammate. Shout oh, yeah. Shout out, shout out first. Uh, it's my boys, AJ, Nock, uh, Nikki, and Josh. And my boy, and the yes, Pen God. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Nation. Thank you. And then, so the profile. So I'll be two Golden Lords. Um, and for, do, you have a, do you have a message for anyone that plays three? Yeah, as a break, don't do that. Yeah, and yeah. they're trash. I understand. In the words of Sosa, they're trash. I understand that if you, you want to play three because of a lot of pro, pro is like a main, a main hand trap now because of tears, and then you can play around the crow by just having the Scarlet set before you use the rewards effect, and so you can dodge the crow. And so it's just play two rewards, uh, so you don't break on them. Amazing. Uh, and if anyone plays three, they should just uh, delete the deck. Yeah, honestly. And they should just all go on TripGaming.com regardless. The deal. Yes, deal. Correct. Um, and they play one spell. Um, I think this is probably the third lord. Uh, you, you get to search the lord, and then there's also a spell or trap, so you can pitch off the lord and you can use it as to search the golden lands. Mm -hmm. And then I play three more spells, which is super poly. It's probably the best power spell in the game. Uh, you can respond to it, and you just break their boards. See you later, board. Yeah. And then after that, I play. 34 traps so i'll play three of each good elves trap um, i know some people play one or two uh, i think three is good this format because it's really good against tears and it hits the spike board somewhat as well mm -hmm. um, and then you kind of want to see them too just so you get your engine going and you don't play prosperity online so it doesn't get negated right yeah so you don't play any Correct. other spells so you totally can't negate it that's right. That's right. In. That's the way to do it, guys. And then the reason why you win the game is the uh -oh. 12 floodgates. <laughs> floodgates. Beautiful. Floodgates Beautiful. Floodgates. Absolutely sexy. Um, yeah. You draw a floodgate, you win the game. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Um, um, game one, it's pretty free. You draw one. You, Literally, you, win, they, win they roll or they, they win can. roll, lose roll, who cares? You just yeah, set win. these, you're good. Even even go second, I understand Toad has taken the gate with Toad. Uh, but the reason. The next card was the like Saving Grace, it was just three Solemn Strike, and then you got three more Solemn Strike from Beautiful. the new set. Beautiful. Um, for people who don't know what this is, uh, basically it's a, you can it's a counter trap that negates a monster effect that is active on the field, and so you just flip up the floodgate, and then and then they get used to the negate, and you just flip this. Amazing. And then they can they still count play through. Amazing it. card. And then I played three Punishments, three TTs. Yeah. Uh, just for back row uh, monster hate and just so you can break the board because I, I think that's like the main exactly. issue of the deck exactly you can't you can't clear the board yeah even though you have floodgates to clear the board some, somewhat they usually have one monster that you have a hard time to deal with so these will help you yeah i agree with those and choices. then during so my last card is a flex spot um i just put a random drowning you're you're, you're kidding you actually play one random drowning. Yeah. Uh, don't I have to that. delete this profile. Don't do that. <laughs> but no, dude, everything up to this point is actually beautiful. I really like this. Yeah, it's pretty it's good. It's like how it would be very similar to how I would build it. Uh, yeah. And at anyone playing branded stuff, they're uh, clowns, right? Yes. Yeah, literally, the, please. If you're playing Bra brand. Brian actually shits on this deck too because they can play around the rivalry and floodgates because they can make Karen Gamera. Yeah. They can just set their monster, Polly, make Yeah, but like Gamera, comparatively, Polly. like Trap Elledge versus Branded Elledge, yeah, like, you just sure. need to play Trap Elledge. Yeah, like, yeah, I don't, I don't even think it's debatable. Exactly. I think, I think the reason why 
is good now because Destro is not floating around anymore. Yeah. And Shrike just beats everything. Yeah. 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 And then, so that's 40 card main. Yeah. Uh, and the sideboard is Triple Spear Mode. Beautiful. Triple Lava Gold. Beautiful. <laughs> I love uh, it. That's going to second card is with Super Poly. Oh, I love yeah. it. Yes, you guys seen Fangs? And then I played three judgments. Going um, first. For going first. And also, I really fear evenly too. Yeah. So I also played tri triple dark barb. And how did that go for you? Uh, never saw it, never needed it. <laughs> <laughs> so don't play this card. And then also, I learned that um, when they prosperity, you can't dark bribe them. So it's really bad. If you know that. <laughs> yeah. And then the last three cards um, was three extravagance. All right. So the idea why you side the pots. Because pots are really good. Like, you want to main them, but against the Toad uh, spike board, they have usually have Toad. And then the Toad can just negate the pot, and you have no other cards to play with afterwards. You'd be just acting in this, the Toad negate, they bring it back with Elf. Um, and they get no Toad, and you're just setting five packs. So you'd play this against anything that doesn't put up spell negates. Yeah, so you'd rather just play another trap, have another trap card in hand at that point. Cool. Yeah. Uh, solid solid uh, side deck there. Can we see the extra deck now? Yeah, extra deck. I uh, played one Mad Golden Lord. Um, regionals, I made this a lot. Uh, yeah, that's interesting. Yeah. Is there any specific duelist that you use this against? Yeah, specific. Um, shot. <laughs> oh, come on, I sold TK my Super Poly, and you, oh my god, still hurts. Yeah, so basically, um, I actually didn't use Super Poly often to clear my opponent's board. I used to a poly to actually make this and kill my opponent. Yeah, when they don't um, expect it. It's, yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty funny. And then I just play right. super poly targets. Venoms, um, three Garuras, <laughs> two Mud Dragons. <laughs> and then I play triple Entis for punishments. Yeah. I play Extravagance, so that's why I play multiple copies of Entis and Garuras and Mud Dragons. And then that's, that's it for super polys. And then I play just four links, friend. So again, Get rid of the floodgates. Trap and village. Yeah, yeah. And also, then, these are nice for the floodgates. Yeah, it's also nice for the floodgates. This for yeah. rivalry and this for the Gozen. Right. And this is the one link. And then I'll just play Underworld Goddess because I have room for it just in case yeah. or anything. Yeah. And I'll play one Omega for punishment as well. Nice. Wow, bro. Absolutely amazing job. Second place of the regional. Anything lastly you want to say? No, not really. Do you think you're better at Lich than Jesse is? Probably not. But do you think you're better than me at a lich? Yes, probably. Yeah. Absolutely cap. What the heck? But anyways, Victor, absolutely amazing job. I'm proud of you. And uh, everyone watching, www.trifficaming.com, you can purchase Victor's uh, feet picks as well as all of my playmats. Yeah. Uh, should they go purchase my playmats? Okay. They should not. They, okay. What the heck? Yo, Ray, Definitely should people should. go on TripGaming.com and buy my play mats? Yo, I, no, I cannot say yes to that because I will be subject to probably cease and desist. Okay. Jesse Cotton, should people go on my website and buy my play mats? <clears throat> no comment. No comment. Uh, guys, should people go on TripGaming.com and buy my play mats? No comment either. Uh, greatest Cube teammate, Sosa. Sosa, should people go on TripGaming.com and buy TripGaming.com play mats? Yes, sir. What, a, what an amazing teammate. <laughs> if we ran back Cube, you guys would go down. Me and Sosa would destroy you guys. You were definitely needed to be carried just yet. <laughs> Sosa played well. He did. My deck did suck ass. His deck was way better. Victor, thank you for the profile. We'll see you guys. We'll see you guys at Wisest Niagara when uh, Victor comes second place and I come first. Peace.